Good afternoon. This is the uh, next to final session of the conference. And the time to reveal a big secret, uh, namely the Stephen Krauer Award for Clarion Young Scientists 2016. Uh, this is an award that now is a relatively new tradition. Uh, the award to be presented at each uh, Clarion annual conference is given to an outstanding young scientist or engineer in recognition of major contributions toward Clarion goals in the areas of language resource building, tool or service development, or knowledge sharing. And the prize consists of a, a certificate, which should be below here. And a 500 euro cash prize. Uh, we received, uh, by the deadline of 14th of September this year, uh, three nominations from the National Consortia, people in the National Consortia. Uh, and the NCF decided to um, establish a small committee in order to evaluate these three, which, by the way, were all outstanding people, and I'm sure there are actually even many more out there. But we had to make a decision, so the NCF put together a committee consisting of Antonio Branco, Eva Haichova, Monica Monachini, Charlie Mert, and Jan Odek, who was the secretary of the committee. The committee decided unanimously to award the prize to Lisbeth Augustinus. I will hand over the prize now, and then uh, the leader of the, please come up. Uh, and then the, the leader of the committee, Jan Odek, will say a few words about the motivation. Here you go. Okay. So you can stay standing here. <laughs> Well, I will say a few things. Okay, let me read from the report that the committee uh, made to motivate why uh, Lisbeth was selected as the winner of this year. Um, Lisbeth Augustinus performed outstanding work on example based tree bank search. She developed the Gretel tool for multi multiple tree banks and languages and made her work available to linguists and other humanities scholars through Clarin. She also promoted this approach and trained intended users and applied the relevant applications in her own PhD research. Example-based search as implemented in Gretel, which stands for Greedy Extraction of Trees for Empirical Linguistics, and its successors offers the possibility to query tree banks on the basis of natural language examples. The user need not know a formal query language, and more, even more importantly, it significantly reduces the need for having exact knowledge of the tree structures and grammar behind the annotations in the tree bank. Lisbeth constructed Kretel initially as a Clarin tool for search in one million token size Dutch corpora. It was extended later by her and her colleagues to search in the 500 million token sonar corpus. It was further extended to other languages, in particular Afrikaans and English. The polygradal variant that she actually showed uh, at, during the bazaar yesterday, uh, the polygradal variant enables cross-lingual example-based querying and is, a and is of special interest for researchers in comparative linguistics and translation studies. Other researchers are extending Gretel in yet other ways. Gretel is also one of the corpus search engines that is used in Talportal uh, to offer a corpus search op options associated with descriptions of grammatical constructions of Dutch. Lisbeth actively, actively, actively promoted the use of Gretel and its successors through lectures and publications, trained the intended users of the applications through workshops and summer schools, and wrote an educational module so that the use of Gretel can also be made part of courses by other teachers. Finally, Lisbeth used Gretel in her own research, which resulted in a novel analysis of verb clusters in the framework of HPSG, written down in her PhD thesis, which was successfully defended on October 8, 2015. 
This PhD thesis was, to our knowledge, the first PhD thesis based on research that crucially used Claren tools. Uh, Lisbeth will continue her research in a new project, which will focus on the use of parallel tree banks for comparative syntax on Dutch, German, and Afrikaans. The example-based query engine Gretel and its successors are very suitable for humanities researchers in general and linguists in particular. It allows the users to start in a very simple and user-friendly way. When they are up to it, they can go one step further by adapting an automatically generated query. In all these respects, Gretel is completely in line with the main clearing goal of applying results of speech and language technology to support research in the humanities. <laughs>